The second initial step to complete is to get your complementary syllabus. From the RCM homepage, search RCM syllabus, and this will take you to the RCM syllabi page. Here you'll see that RCM publishes syllabi for over 20 instruments, voice, and speech arts and drama. I'm going to go to the piano syllabus, click download, and there is my syllabus. The initial pages provide you lots of introductory information about the program. A quick and clear view of the contents, an introduction, some getting started information, and some phone calls, phone numbers to call if you need support. All of the exam requirements are fully described on page 9, 10, and 11. The digital syllabi are also searchable. There are many links throughout that will take you to more specific information if you want to see it. On the contents page, for example, if I would like to see a level 3 program and requirements, I click on the level 3 and it links me to the actual page where level 3 begins. Each level starts with the marking rubric for that particular exam and followed immediately by the repertoire lists divided by style period. The list A repertoire are Baroque style pieces, the list B are the classical style pieces, and the list C, typically the longest list in each program, are the Romantic, 20th, and 21st century pieces. This repertoire anthology is a fabulous resource for all teachers. You're sure to find music that is very familiar to you by composers such as Kabalevsky, Bartok, Shostakovich, and Schumann, and there are many gems that you have not yet discovered by composers such as Lieberman, Peskanov, Tansman, and Dennis Alexander, Kevin Olson, and Martha Mir, and many, many more. Participating in the RCM certificate program ensures that your students will always have lots of great repertoire on hand to participate in local recitals, festivals, and other performance events. At the end of this repertoire list, we now see the technical test listed for each level, and this does include etudes. Begin here, and they conclude here on the next page. And right here at the top, we see the specific technical tests for level three, the figures, their keys, how they are to be played, and tempo recommendations. Students always play etudes. From levels three through 10, they play two etudes and one etude in each level one and two. The technical tests for each level are always clearly laid out, so students have no difficulty seeing what is required for them at any level. After the technical requirements for each level, we see the musicianship requirements, which include ear training and sight reading. The ear training requirements include a clapback exercise, interval recognition, chord recognition, and a melody playback exercise, an exercise where students are given a tonic triad and a short melody which they play back after two hearings. For the sight reading tests, students are asked to read in two ways. The first is rhythm only, and the second is a short piece which they are asked to play after a quick review. Some comments about the books and materials needed for the program. RCM publications are not required to participate in the RCM certificate program. Students may use any published edition of their repertoire to participate. One of the great advantages to using the RCM Celebration Series for Piano is that each book comes with a digital recording of every piece. Teachers may want to have some library sets on hand for their reference and for use in planning, and this might include the repertoire and etude books and the four-star sight reading series, which also provides sample tests in the back of each book. These are great to use in lessons. Students may want to take advantage of the discounted packages for each level 
which bundle their repertoire, etudes, sight reading, technical tests, and theory book at a, dip, a discounted price. Students will definitely want to use the online ear training app to practice the ear skills between lessons. For about $5 a month, the app provides students thousands of ear training examples and provides access to all levels in the program. It also saves a lot of time in lessons when students can practice their ear skills between sessions with their teacher. There is also the online theory study guide for levels 5 through 8. Working through theory has never been more fun for students. This is a great support for your teaching and students will really enjoy the interactive format. Students wishing to take an RCM theory exam should know that they can purchase both the study guide for their level and the exam together at a deep discount. You will enjoy reviewing the wonderful music and supporting materials available. Again, not required for participation in the program, but excellent pedagogically sound publications for both instrument and voice. Congratulations, you've now completed step two.